don't want to walk here and they think that they are shitting on me. You don't know you are not shitting on me. I want to make you human being. You said you are shitting. Eh? He, he wants me to become a slave for him. I want you to become blessed, developed and be fruitful. I can't teach you what cannot benefit you. Mention Esther. Esther had a character. It was Esther's attitude that brought her to the king's palace. Read chapter 2 of Esther from verse 1 to 14. And won't go the basis. Hallelujah. To become a virgin is not only for the person a woman or has to get married to a king. A woman that has not seen a man before must also try to do what? Acquire an attitude and a character. Are you hearing me? A woman can be a virgin and have a disability character. A woman can be a virgin and be very ugly in character. Are you hearing me? Praise the name of the Lord. Character. Character is the most beautiful, the most beautiful asset of a woman. The most beautiful asset of every woman being is what? Is character. Why do we spend one hour, 30 minutes, two hours, three hours in the shops? Why do we pay millions on Naira for a cinema outside the country, within the country, inviting only one person to talk to us for five days? We are looking for character. What are we looking for? Attitude. So that we can make that company more beautiful. We can make that company more unique. We can make that company healthier. We can make that company more successful. That's why we pay hundreds of thousands in seminar. Do you know that they go to seminar on how to dress up? On how to dress up to address people. Do you know they pay millions of naira on how to dress up? On how to dress up to stand before public and talk to them. Do you know? There's a way you would dress and they talk to people, people will be attracted to you. Hallelujah. They pay millions also to learn how to talk to people. And it's not easy if you don't know what you want, you can't sit and wonder in leader for two hours. Your presence will be working. Contrary to his discipline, to his ideas, because you don't know what it takes to raise up a, a leader. If you, if you are not looking for something tangible, like what the leader is looking for, you can stay within three days. You don't know what the only man can say to you. I don't like how that woman is behaving. I don't like how that woman is behaving. This is someone that took minimum of 15 years to build the car. He said he don't like what he's doing. Praise the Lord. Brothers and sisters, and you are still summarizing my message and my administration and my word of direction by telling, charging each and every one of us in here to go for an attitude. What? An attitude. I'm an animal. She's so beautiful. I'm an animal. I'm an animal. I'm an animal. I'm an animal. I'm an だだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだだ
and I have let me not say let me let me display the devil. Wait and come in. So I felt that my thank God. So people did not suspect me that I am use their children for ritual. And I'm begging you to take their children. Do you know what it means for someone to say, Oh my child, for three days and call me? If they suspect you, they won't allow you to give that child a deceit at all for a second. It's a credibility. For someone to say, Go and take my children for me from the school. Have you ever asked yourself, Do you remember my life when you gave me my life now? Have you ever asked yourself, why have you parents asked me to go and take their children for them from the school? In a poor that is a young man, young boy, young girl. Have you ever asked yourself that question? You are under heavy suspicion. Heavy suspicion. You are under heavy suspicion. That's why nobody will ask you to go to school to bring their children. I'm talking about attitude. When you are doing good things, you think people are not watching you. People are watching you and they will be calling you for so many things. And you will tell them, I am busy. I am what? I am busy. Oh, people might have asked by yourself, like, hey, raise yourself for a positive price. It shall be well with you. I am not afraid of failure. I am asking for some more maturity. I need to be more mature. I need to be more myself to be qualified for the riches of this land. There are a lot of riches. I don't need to beg somebody to bless me. When you are rich, somebody will be glad to assist you. Somebody will be glad to support you. Somebody, when you are rich in attitude, somebody will say, I'm happy that I am not supporting to assist that God. Let's open this as I'm blessed. Amen. I don't know. Don't you know that? There are people that are happy when they give you money, they, they go home and rejoice in that. They go around them to give you money. Only my father said, No God, give me the best characters. Only my father said, No God, give me the best, best characters. Best attitude of your work. What are we going to trust you to do? I see a lot of people that are not going to do it. As I'm going to talk to me, see you like people that never know to talk to me. We oh. think of so yeah, that is need to stop on it. We do not do it. How can somebody that's not give you opportunity? Your father is a hand is a handicap. Your mother is a handicap. And you have to see a brother, a sister, a relation that keep you in the house as a cousin. And you cannot manage that little position. Your mother said no more. Remember that people they see you on the road say, and say I like you and think that your character is also good. But after some time, they will they will they will refuse their statement by saying that what they saw three days ago is not what they see you today. But people can say it. Anyway. Praise the Lord. Wherever you are, ask God for attitude. Praise the Lord. Many of us here cannot keep 10,000 miles for people for one month. I can hear and follow you then. What about if that money is not given to you? What will you do? Someone give you a thought to keep. He says, Dear Direction, where I can't deny you, you are not when the answer said, Oh God, give me an attitude. Amen. Take note of Daniel chapter, chapter 6, verse 3, people of God. You are on your way to 11 to 1 miracle. Amen. Let me hear you say, I am a candidate. Am a candidate. candidate of 11 to 1 miracle. Lift up your hands and say, I am a candidate. Lift up your hands and say, I am a, I am a candidate. Take note of 6 2. Sorry for taking a bit of your time. Daniel chapter 6 verse 2. You are I, I'm imparting us with the word so that you will know exactly what a level tower miracle is. When you are allowed to manage a store, don't think that the person that gave you the store is a foolish person. Manage that store well so that in due course you will have your own store. Daniel chapter 6 verse 3. Are we all there? 
then this Daniel distinguished himself above the governors, above and the satraps, because an excellent spirit was in him, and the king gave thought to sitting to setting him over the whole realm, over the whole, over the whole realm, over the whole realm. You will be set up over the whole realm. You will be set up over the whole realm as you believe the Lord. Believing God means walking your character towards the word, towards the word of God. Take note of First Corinthians chapter twelve, verse thirty-one. First Corinthians chapter twelve, verse thirty-one. I said you are on your way to eleven tower miracle. Stop thinking that you cannot have it. Eleven tower miracle. Eleven. First Corinthians chapter twelve, verse one, verse thirty-one. But earnestly, let's read it together. That's the key word. But earnestly desire the best gifts, and yet I show you a more excellent way. Yet I show you a more. Let's read it together. First Corinthians chapter twelve, verse thirty-one, in a loud voice. But you earnestly desire the best gifts, and yet I show you a more excellent way. Paul is writing here. A man that was an enemy of God, an enemy of the church. But when he was called by God, he humbled himself in the word of God and develop an attitude. May God give you grace to humble yourself in the word of God. May you develop an attitude, a best character, best character that will catapult you to the presidential level, to the secretarial level, to the state level, even to the heavenly level, to the to the high power, high sophisticated financial level, to the high level, high level of very big office, as same may you develop a character. Praise the name of the Lord. May you develop a character, attitude of the word of God. But Paul said, but I initially desire the best word, the best gift. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Daniel chapter 1 verse 20. 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 Are we all there? And in all matters of wisdom and understanding, about to which the king examined them, he found them ten times better than all the magicians and astrologers who were in all his realm. May you found may you be found better. May you be found better than everyone in the society in the name of Jesus Christ I say may you be found better in Jesus Christ's name Daniel chapter 1 verse 9 Daniel chapter 1 verse 9 his reward now God had brought Daniel into the favor and the good will of the sheep of the Enos why? because of the gift of wisdom and the interpretation of dream in him hallelujah when you are walking towards the word of God, at the end of the day, God will bless you with a gift that will make a way for you. Hallelujah. 18, 18, 18 verse 16, Proverbs. A gift of a man makes a room for him and brings him before great people. And brings him before great people. Gift of a man makes a room for him. Proverbs chapter 18, 18 verse Verse 6, a man's gift to mercy room for him and brings him before great, great men. When you have a gift, your gift will always make a room for you. May you receive a gift. How many of us were touched when my son was singing a song this morning? How many of us? He plays piano, he plays drum. A very young boy of 16 years and plus. 16 years and few days. Don't correct me, Oga. I say 16 years plus. Is that not what I said? Praise the name of the Lord. 16 years plus. 16 years plus. He plays drum. He plays keyboard. This keyboard and I bandit man the meaning ever. He plays it. Please praise the Lord. When you see good thing, say it. Admire it. Admire it. Admire it. Stop preaching the spirit. And at the end of the day, you go to people who say you have a burden, you complaining one thing or the other. 
Let me how to come out and say that I have a testimony. And people will not know that it is because of two, three people you come out to share testimony with. That so 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 person, you want to thank God for her gift. So 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 person, you want to thank God for her gift. So 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 person, you want to thank God for her gift. Shush, sure, they should praise the Lord for you. And you are thanking God for using you to also thank God for the gift of so so brother, so so sis, so so brother. You hand over the microphone. And you see what the Lord will do that week. Let us keep the spirit of self-centeredness. It's the spirit of wickedness. Spirit of self-centeredness. When somebody is sharing testimony, in a long time, and if you leave this church, you go to another church and be still practicing the same thing in forever. May God deliver us. We'll be looking at that person as if he's doing magic. May God deliver us. And say, may God deliver us. Just use time to look at somebody's face by your side when people are sharing testimony. And see how many people that are smiling. May God deliver us from Obi Ojo. Jesus Christ, man. You want a blessing and you are not healing another person's blessing. How will you receive a blessing when you are not rejoicing for another person's miracle? Don't you know it's a medicine? It's a key to receive a blessing for rejoicing for other people's blessing. The Bible says we should rejoice with those that do what? And even cry with those that are crying. May God help us. Amen. I know that after sharing the grace, we will not teach people to follow this gate. Now this gate will go follow go home. Everyone of us know that we will follow the gate. Nobody. We are not going to, nobody will be going like this. I said, no, no be road though. All of us know that that's the entrance. Even my, our little children are there. Shall we, shall we ask God for an attitude? Oh God, my God, oh God, my God. give me wisdom. <laughs> wisdom that is full of mercy. Wisdom that have no partiality. Wisdom that is a, a, a justified wisdom. Rise up on your feet, I said, oh God, give me a justified wisdom. A justified wisdom. I had patience that we are coming to this on the school. Time did not permit me to come out. Yes. Rise up on your feet. Rise up on your feet. Rise up on your feet. Begin to thank God and say, Oh God. What are the things that are disqualifying men from having my miracles, from having my desires, from having my expectations? Take it away from me. Open your mouth and say, Take it away from me. Take it away from me. Take it away from me. Anything disqualifying me from having my miracles, my desires, and my expectations. Oh God, take it away from me. Is it arrogant? Is it envy? Is it pride? Is it self-centered spirit? Is it selfish character? Is it wickedness? Is it arrogant? Any spirit, any attitude, any character hindering me from having my expectations, my my desires, my miracles, oh God, take it away from my life. Brethren, pray, pray, pray. Take it away from me. Save me, O oh God. Wash me by the blood of Jesus Christ. Wash me by the blood of Jesus Christ. Wash me by the blood of Jesus Christ. The Bible says that, that Daniel had an excellent spirit. In Daniel chapter 6 verse 3, where we just read. And he was distinguished above the governors and above the settlers. Attitude, any spirit, any character, disqualifying me from having my desires and my expectations. Oh God, take it away from me. Oh God, open it from my life. Prayers, come to God. And let any attitude we implore. As for these four young men, God gave them knowledge and skill in all literature and wisdom. And Daniel had understanding in all visions and in dreams.
Jesus. In Jesus Christ's name, let the congregation say Amen. Oh God, my God, we bless that attitude in me with the best gift. He said, I should seek for more excellent character, more excellent gifts. He bless that as attitude in me, that spirit in my life, which disqualifies me, that character, this character, this attitude that disqualifies me from having my expectations and my desires and my miracles. Lord, take it away from me. For I had in your word that many and God may feel at you. I will never be happy to be disqualified at the last hour, at the last time, at the last hour. I want to be among the shoes, among the shoes, among the few that will be shoes. I know that in the last day, I know that at the end of this meeting, hundreds, thousands, millions of people, billions of people, as a few, will be shoes. For the miracle of the level tower, will be qualified for the miracle of the level tower. Count me one, count me one, count me one, count me one, count me one. Give me that attitude, that character, which Esther had, which Joseph had, which Daniel had, which David had, that enabled them to possess their desires, their desires, that enabled them to achieve the kingdom of heaven. Give it to me. Open your heart and say, Give it to me. Give it to me. And frustrate to them any character in my life. Frustrate in my life. Does not allow me to possess my desires and my and my and my expectations. Hold of frustrate it until it dies. Frustrate it to death. Frustrate it to death. Give me a flavor. Give me a character, a behavior, anointing, the unction, the power, the ability that will enable me, that will qualify me to have my expectations as well to. As we do, as we do, character for divine attraction, attitude for divine attraction. Open your mouth and pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Open your mouth and pray. Lift up your voice. Begin to pray. Pray, 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 pray. Give it to us. Thank you, God.
do you want God to touch you, my friend? Where do you want God to touch you? Do you need a development of a character? Where do you want God to touch you? Is it your marriage? Is there any of your son, your daughter, that you want God to touch? Do you want God to touch your brain, your heart, your marriage, your wife, or your husband? Your working place? Do you want God to touch your family? Do you want God to touch your life? And make your life awesome. Remove it. Heal all the 